we have a ball that is suspended and it's kept in front of a conducting plane so initially the time period was noticed and later some charge was given to the ball and it was noticed that time period changes two times now what conducting plane does it, it will create a mirror charge at the same distance so if this is h at the same distance h there will be a mirror charge but the sign of the charge will be opposite so if plus q is given here the mirror charge will have the value of minus q so when you do that the g effective will increase and if g effective will increase you we know time period is 2 pi root l by g effective so if g effective increases time period decreases so when he says period is changed two times we know that it is reduced two times so that's that we have to figure out so he has not given it is increased or decreased but we have to figure out that because the force will be towards bottom so the time period will reduce so when changed when slightly disturbed h will not change significantly so let's assume this uh, force mg and kq square by 2h square both are constants and now we can write mg effective on this ball is mg plus kq square by 4h square since both the forces are constant we can write that this gives g effective to be this now it's given that second time period t2 is 1 by eta times t1 so as discussed it's reduced so it will be t1 by eta so t1 is 2 pi root l by g initially and t2 will be 2 pi root l by g effective we put the value of g effective here and we'll get the value of q all right